the bottom line is that we have a problem of increasing gun violence in Canada. The federal government is hoping to crack down on gun violence. Their solution is Bill C-71. The legislation looks to enhance background checks and force commercial retailers to keep inventory and sales records, among other things. But what was on everyone's mind today was a call to ban all assault rifles in Canada. It's an idea that, uh, that has been proposed. Uh, when the details of uh, the exact measures are, uh, are available for study, I would, uh, I would look at this. Calls to outlaw assault rifles grew louder following the Quebec City mosque shooting in January 2017 that killed six. The shooter, Alexander Bissonnet, started his rampage with the legal 223 caliber rifle, which jammed on the first shot, prompting him to use a smaller handgun. Many questioned how much worse things could have been had it not jammed. This week, Prime Minister Justin Trudeau received a letter signed by 75 people expressing their dismay that the government's bill does not ban the weapons. Goodale was careful not to dismiss the idea. It is an idea that I'm certainly prepared to examine. While some have concerns about assault rifles, others believe Canada doesn't have a problem with them. The good news is we already don't have them. Tracy Wilson is with the Canadian Coalition for Firearm Rights. She doesn't believe a rifle like an AR-15 qualifies as an assault rifle. Assault weapons have been banned in Canada for decades. An assault weapon is a firearm that um, has the option of being full auto. And we don't have that here in Canada. Defining the classification of a firearm is an issue the government is looking to fix by giving that authority to the RCMP. But that doesn't change the way Wilson feels about the legislation. I'm a little disappointed in the direction this is going, but I think it's a, a failed attempt to make it appear that they are doing something. After contacting the RCMP to find out how they define an assault rifle, it became clear that part of the problem may be in the definition. The force replied with a lengthy email that starts off by saying the answer is complex and goes on to talk about the history of the term and the different definitions in English and French. Bill C-71 just passed second reading in the House of Commons. In Ottawa, Nigel Newlove, A City News.